Hi everybody, it's August 30, 2019. I don't, oh God, I don't know what is going on with my mind, but I completely forgot to include in the video that I just posted the frequencies that were being blasting, they, they just blasted away on uh, the radar site. Right now, this is current time, it's 3.46 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. As you can see, radar, Doppler radar, next thread, it is activated at a, uh, certainly a less, lesser power level. They've decreased the power level. This was what was happening at 12, what time? 12.39 p.m blasting away okay uh, very important because it is at a time when you don't see radar blasting away like this from Virginia right on through to Texas and yeah what I've been catching boy Radar, we are seeing things that are very different. Look at that nicely defined Hurricane Dorian right smack there at the top. Uh, electromagnetic frequencies ripping right through Dorian. Look at this nice defined manufactured cloud up here at the top. This whole thing manufactured by man. And if you, you know, just watch closely, you will see the signatures of the electromagnetic frequencies that they are using to create this hurricane. And the manufactured clouds right down here. So this was at 1239. Uh, do I have anything else? Oh yeah. Okay. I will be posting another video on what was happening in Nebraska, Kansas, Missouri. Last night I looked for weather reports. I could not find any, but I did get a comment from a subscriber and thank you for leaving that comment let me pull it up we did have last night uh, I guess a Lando Cane over Indiana more flooding starting in Missouri and Kansas pray and be prepared not surprised based on what I saw on radar so Look at all of the sawtooth frequencies that anybody want to do some research? Sawtooth frequencies, weather modification. Um, you see all of the jagged edge? It looks like a serrated edge. That's called a sawtooth frequency, which is uh, a different kind of frequency and you see all of the defined circular lines here that represents Nexrad radar pulsing their high frequencies into the ionosphere that then they release and it bounces back down as extremely low frequencies and they can create a whole lot of weather severe weather events so 12:39 and look at all of the frequencies in this storm all right i really just wanted to document uh the frequencies that were being set off right along the gulf states 
East Coast on up to Virginia. Yes, I do believe that they are setting these things off. It's uh, connected to Dorian. How are you feeling in these states, guys? How are you feeling? Just let me tell you, I am getting, well, a little, oh, let's say, annoyed at how I am feeling. Got this ear pressure right now. Look at this rectangle of a storm. I mean, come on, come on. I want Americans' brains back. So, um, these weather events, boy, just keep going on. And if it's not the biggest hurricane ever, these, well, severe weather events that cause an awful lot of destruction. Why is it so difficult for me to get even weather reports on what is happening? That's why I need you guys to report to me, to all of us, what is happening in your areas. Like that person who left, uh, Linda, thank you. Um, but I want to know the details of what is taking place. This, um, okay, is current time. So they have decreased the power levels and the frequencies that they were using earlier today. This is Hurricane Dorian now. Look at all of the nice lines that develop right here. I don't know if you can see it in this video. Let me see if I can change the color. Well, I just changed the, uh, just changed it to shortwave and look at the eye. Ah, it is a square. It turns into a nice square, then rectangle. I can still see the lines here. Look at how unbelievably defined is this right over here. And you can see these bizarre um, I can't zoom in anymore. If I hit the zoom, it gets smaller. But you see, let's see, let's do it this way. Okay, you see how nicely defined that is. And if, yeah. Sorry folks, but mother nature does not work in square eyes to a hurricane. Precisely defined. But right before that, can you see what, a, what uh, it looks like um, you can see one line here, a line above it, and then like nicely spaced slats <laughs> uh, look how long do we have to live this i guess our entire lives <laughs> look how nicely defined that is but hang on whoops you can see the lines and you can see the <laughs> the growth of more manufactured cloud. Um, but can you see all of the ripples? These are microwaves. They're shooting right into this. Look at the lines down here, which look, 
Uh, I'm not sure if what we are seeing now, these lines, if they're the, you know, the spraying of aerosols or the manufacturing of cloud hit with microwaves. But can you see all of the ripples right here? It's unbelievable. It's so easy to now see that man is manufacturing another hurricane. Here's a nice green. You can see that they are uh, creating more and more cloud, but you can see the lines more clearly. They're just developing in this. Look at this. Microwaves in use. Well, here's a nice satellite photo for you. Look at this. Look at this. Nice defined section of this hurricane. Look at the ripples. That's the high frequencies heating up. Superheating of this storm. It's getting closer and closer to Florida. Well, Floridians, you can thank your weather terrorists for bringing you yet another weather event. I am so tired of watching destruction unfold. How about you guys? A little bit tired of this? Yeah. I hope you say yeah. I'm mad as hell and I'm not gonna take it anymore. Hello? Was that just a movie to watch? Or was it a movie to learn from? It was a movie to learn from. You know, it's so obvious now. That's what is so kind of Kafka-esque. Unbelievable. <laughs>